Let us learn about angles made by a transversal with two lines. Suppose AB and CD are two lines cut by a transversal PQ at points L and M respectively. The transversal makes eight angles with the two lines AB and CD. These angles are marked as 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7 and 8. So, in the figure, angle 1, angle 2, angle 7 and angle 8 are such angles whose none of the arms contain the segment LM. These are exterior angles. Hence, the angles whose arms do not contain the segment on the transversal cut by the given lines are called exterior angles. Also, angle 3, angle 4, angle 5 and angle 6 are such angles whose one of the arms contains the segment LM. These are interior angles. Hence, the angles whose one of the arms contains the segment on the transversal cut by the given lines are called interior angles. In the on-screen figure, each pair of angles 2, 6, 1, 5, 3, 7 and 4, 8 is such that one arm of both the angles of the pair is on the same side of the transversal PQ and the other arms are directed in the same sense. These angles form pairs of corresponding angles. Hence, a pair of angles in which one arm of both the angles of the pair is on the same side of the transversal and the other arms are directed in the same sense is called a pair of corresponding angles. Let us now learn what are alternate interior and exterior angles. A pair of angles in which one arm of each of the angles is on opposite sides of the transversal and whose other arms include the segment LM is called a pair of alternate interior angles.